okay beautiful people welcome back to this channel Lolity stitches so good to have you guys back so today it is just a very quick one i'll be teaching you how to attach band to a skirt okay how to attach band to a skirt it's very simple and very easy you know the importance of attaching band to a skirt is to avoid unnecessary exposure while you are bending down or so so it's just to give your skirt a very good shape and to avoid unnecessary exposure the best um, way to measure the best way to measure for your skirt is to open up the zip okay like this and uh, go ahead to measure it round this is the best way can you see So this is the best way to measure, can you see that 34 inches and that is what I'll be making use of. So this is the band I'll be making use of and I have a length of 36, a length of 37 inches and a width of 4 inches, okay? I added 3 inches extra for the... Remember the waist is 34, but I added 3 inches extra for a reason. Just keep watching, you will understand. So as you can see, I've gone ahead to attach gum stay. I'm going to go ahead now and give it a good press. So on folder, we have 2 inches. I've taken to the pressing iron and I've given it a good press. And this is what I have, okay? One side with the gum stay and the other side no okay can you see that so then you take your sewing machine then you take to your sewing machine and stitch okay one inch one inch of maximum see I yeah I used one three quarter okay one three quarter inches that's what I stitched okay Remember, on fold now we have two inches. But you are going to go ahead and, and stitch one three quarter inch on one side, okay? On one side. Then we are going to turn it to the right side. Okay, you can just notch it. So we are going to turn it to the right side, bring it out. Okay, just like that this is what I have and the other hand is open is for a reason okay so remember we didn't finish the stitch so we are going to have this opening so what we are going to do now is to open up the zip of the skirts can you see that open it up then here is your band remember this side has the gum stay and this side does not so the side that doesn't have the gum stay now can you see the opening we left the side that doesn't have the gum stay you pick it up and attach it from inside from the wrong side okay not from outside from the wrong side now and you pin it up okay So you are going to pin it like that all around. So you pin it like that all around and you take that to your sewing machine. Okay, let me take it to the sewing machine now and show you what next to do okay so can you see now i've taken it to the sewing machine and from inside i mean from the wrong side i've gone ahead to stitch with half an inch all through can you see that started stitching from here all through to this place and this is the other end that i told you to open up and not close can you see that 
okay so now the next stage open, open up your skirt like this to get the side stitch okay this is a six piece skirt here is the side stitch so you have to be very careful there are a lot of stitches there are a lot of joinings the six piece skirt you have to take note of the side stitch and here is my side stitch okay so on this side stitch now i'm going to open it up at the band level and i will draw a line okay can you see i'm drawing a line connecting to the side stitch i'm going to repeat the same on the other side stitch this is the other side stitch and i'll repeat the same can you see that so for this stage now, for this procedure, we'll be needing our elastic elastic band, one inch wide elastic band, not the, not that tiny one. We'll be needing this. So I'll be needing six inches of this elastic band, six inches. Okay. So I'll cut it into two. That will give me. And you see that now that I've divided into it into two, I have three inches. Okay, so I'll use one for this side, one for the other side. From this center mark, I'll mark three inches here, three inches here. So this is to give it a side elastic so that it can be well secured on your waist. Okay, so I'll take to the sewing machine now, okay, and run a stitch here. I'll drag it. Let me take to this. Let's go to the sewing machine together. Okay, guys. So welcome to my sewing workshop. Now I'm measuring out the three inches that I marked out earlier, and I'll pick my elastic band, the three inches that we cut out earlier. It's time to stitch it on the band, just as I'm doing right now. Place it on the first three inch and stitch. Okay. Do well to back stitch like two times so that it will be strong and firm enough on the band. And now that you have done that, okay, so I'm just trimming out my thread. Then you will drag the elastic now to the other three inches, not the center now. Remember, there is a center mark, then three inches on both sides. So we are dragging it to the other three inch on the other side, okay? So I'm also going to stitch that and make sure it is firm on the waistband. So this is the side elastic and the essence of this is to make the skirt sit well on your waist to make the band firm. That's why we are attaching this side elastic and um, it really makes the skirt band look so beautiful and look so nice. So I'm just trimming out the thread now. So what I've done here now, remember we marked it on the two side seam of the skirt. So I'm going to repeat this same process for the other side of the skirt. Can you see how stretching it is? So I'm going to repeat the same process for the other side of the skirt. And now I'll open up my zip and start covering the stitch, okay? So I'll just fold the half inch remaining and cover up the other stitch gently now i want to ensure that it is one inch okay we don't want the band height to be more than one inch and at most let's say 1.5 inches we don't want it too high so now we we'll start stitching and covering up uh, the stitch i made earlier to have a nice uh, finishing so that is what i'm doing right now take your time to arrange it can you see what I'm doing? So take your time to arrange it and make sure it's not more than that one inch. So arrange it and stitch gently and carefully, okay? So that is what I'm doing now. That is what I'm doing now. I can assure you if you follow every step of this tutorial, you'll come out with a very beautiful uh, skirt band. So this is what I'm doing now. I'm trying to arrange it and make sure it's fine. Can you see me continuously? checking the one inch 
just to make sure that we are not exceeding that one inch and now that we have gotten to the elastic part it, it can be a little bit tricky but don't worry don't worry you can do it all you have to do is to stretch it out can you see what i'm doing now so you stretch out the elastic and um, you gently arrange that stitch and fold it over make sure to cover that elastic make sure the band is covering the elastic okay so that is what i'm doing right now it can take a little bit of force but just make sure you're stretching it out and gently start stitching okay also stretch it out can you see that just stretch it out stretch it out and arrange it can prove to be a little bit difficult but be resilient stretch it out and stitch gently just as I'm doing now okay I'll be glad if you do this and share with me your experience how it was you can even snap and send the picture of what you did okay and uh, thank you so much guys thank you for always checking this channel out if you have not subscribed to my channel and this video has added any value to you please kindly subscribe right now and remember to hit that notification bell so that you get notified each time i upload a new video you can also share the video okay so that other people can know how to stitch this band and know that it's very simple so we've got to the other side of the of the band now you know we attached the elastic to two sides so this is the other side i'm going to repeat the same process stretch it out stretch out the elastic remember we have stitched it firmly so don't be afraid stretch it out and gently fold the band on top just like this arrange it and continue stitching yeah continue stitching just like that i prefer this process because it's better than just attaching band so most of the time those bands without elastic will be jumping around your waist so i prefer this elastic but in fact mommies our mommies they prefer this um, style so it's an old style but it's, it's really nice so arrange it well and stitch so now when you get to the end that other end that we did not close so you are going to fold it gently like this this is why we did not fold it so that um, in case you get chubby tomorrow you have added some weight and the band is now tight you can easily lose it and readjust so this is just like a band allowance where we will fold it and make sure it's one inch that is what i'm trying to confirm there Make sure it's one inch and stitch, okay? So that is it. Thank you so much for watching. Um, I will show you the hand result now. Thank you so much for watching. Remember to subscribe. And I will see you in my next one. Okay guys, so can you see the hand result of our beautiful band, skirt band? It's, it has this way of stabilize, it sits well on your waist and it makes the skirt come out really nice. Can you see that? So this is the one inch, so, and this is the elastic at the side. That's what will make it really sit well. Then mom is used to like this tie then you have all we have to do now is to zip up in my skirt hook i'm just going to use my needle and thread to attach that